adventure rig outdoors back here on the boat project my 14 foot bay walker so far i've gotten worked pretty hard on it i've done two layers of fiberglass all around nut we'll do a bit show you here in a second right now i'm waiting on it to dry tomorrow hopefully i can come back and sand and put another one on there Working pretty good. All the way down. I've shown you in my other videos too. Doing three layers just because originally we we're just going to do two. But I decided to do three here and three in the front because it's a little weak in my opinion. So. I decided to go ahead and finish it. Didn't do a video the other day showing me filling in the gaps here, but right here I had sanded down all the way to the wood. It had a pretty good spot right here that was a tad rotten. So sanded that out. It's all good now. Another spot over here. Let's see if we can't get it better. Filled it in with body filler. One thing you gotta watch out with this is splinters whenever the fiberglass is drying because there's always these hairs that shoot off and everything, they're sharp. So, back's pretty solid now. So, show you this side all the way up to the front. Uh, been looking at these lids on. Amazon and such and I just don't like the lids all, at all really so been thinking of ways and me and dad came up with a way just gonna get some aluminum and just gonna have a lid that sits over the top here I'm gonna bevel the side so it's not sharp and then I'm probably gonna come back and put a that foam padding the deck mat all on the deck uh, luckily I have the aluminum. I have an old, uh, what do you call it? Uh, toolbox that my is broken and screwed up. So, I'll be cutting it apart for these three lids. And I might do the rest. Uh, plan going forward is we're going to Get this done should have had it done this week but we had work with pretty long so we're going to work on get this done tomorrow all the way around then we're going to go through here and do patch this spot patch right there and right there then we're going to build the console and it's going to go about right here We'll put this here so you can see just about where it's going to be. Be right out in the middle. Let me get the motor hooked up. I'll walk over there here in a second and show you the motor. So, get that done. Then we're going to drive in and figure out if we like it or not. If we like it, then here forward is going to be entirely uh, decked next year. At probably actually this winter I'll deck it and then next year it's going to get paint job. Did a lot of work, got a lot of runs with the uh, epoxy resin so I'm going to sand those off, uh, probably not for right now since I'm going to paint it probably in six months because I really really like this boat so that's looking pretty good gonna have to figure out if my uh, jack plate fits lines up with these holes if it doesn't that's not a big deal I'll make new holes had one issue with these people the last dude who did this who tried to rebuild this boat did a horrible job and I'd personally like to have a talk with him made these tried to make these self bailing scupper holes he didn't drill the hole all the way through so 
fact that this transom isn't rotten rotten is amazing so got a few little patches on the bottom i gotta do so uh, originally i think in my first video i still had them on i had uh what do you call it railing that goes here and a little on the fence i'm putting it back if i put it back on i'm gonna make it to where i can clamp on some led lights some big lights so if i decide to go bow fishing or something or flounder gigging or whatever i can i always have lights available one thing i'm doing right now is going through and filling in all these holes there's, a couple, there's one right there i sanded it down before i fill them in though i'm stuffing them full of uh johnson grass twigs everything i can find works a little bit better if it's less runny fortunately yeah that's pretty good so i bring some plywood home from work got some that will work i know it will so i get to bust out that console hopefully this week get it at least cut out screwed together screwed in so so far i'm really really happy with this so talk about my boat motor next next video we're going to talk about my boat motor so go ahead and like and subscribe please